Okay, so let's make a deterministic finite automaton for this language, which is the set of all binary strings, w, where w has length at most 5. So how are we going to build a DFA for this? Well, once we have reached length 6, then no matter what we read after the fact, that's not going to result in being back in this language. And so therefore, we need to have a whole bunch of states in a row, and some state that represents the sixth character that we've read, which means we're not going to accept at that point. So we need to make a whole bunch of states in a row. So here's one transition, which means we've read one thing, we've read two things, we've read three, we've read four, we've read five. And then this last one is the sixth one, and so therefore should not be an accepting state. But all the other ones before, we've read five or fewer characters and should all be accepting. And coupled with the fact that we do not care what the actual characters are, just that we have five or fewer of them, I'm gonna have all of these be either zero or one. And we can even extend this to any non-binary alphabet if we wanted to, just by adding more things on each transition. So then we've read five things if we got to this state. So if we read one more, that means we have read six things. And we should allow ourselves to read through the rest of the string because it, after all, it is a DFA. And so therefore, I'm gonna have a dead state down here that just blasts through all the remaining characters. And so therefore, this is a DFA for all binary strings, W, where W has length at most five.